Welcome back to the 7 on 8. If you watch every night, you know that we've expanded our Ask Ellen segment. And today's question comes from Lexi with an assist from her mom and little brother. Is this how they make hail? <laughs> That's a good question. Ask Ellen. Say, Ellen, is this how they make hail? Ellen, is this how they make hail? I know those kids. I love it. We love those kids. You know what's interesting is we're getting this question not just from kids but adults today oh, too. Yeah. So yeah. this was a big surprise when you saw the wintry mix. It wasn't just rain and snow. This is something called grapple or soft hail. So let's go ahead and show you some pictures of grapple first. When you see grapple, it hits and it bounces. But when you pick it up, unlike real hail, it's spongy. So it kind of reminds you of Dippin' Dots ice cream. For Oof. some people that remember that, yeah. Don't tempt me. Has that kind of <laughs> consistency. So now that you know what to look for, let's talk about how it differs from the other types of precipitation. So if we break down the precipitation types, rain is just drops of liquid water, snow, delicate forms of ice, sleet are hard, tiny ice shards, hail, big solid balls of ice, and grapple, spongy balls. And they all form a little bit differently. So rain, for example, is a raindrop and it falls all the way down to the ground without changing one bit. Snow, same thing, some dendrites form and it stays cold all the way down to the ground. Sleet or ice shards start as uh, snow, but then they, or start as a raindrop, but then it refreezes on the way down to the ground. Hail gets lots of different layers of ice while it's in the cloud and then falls, but grapple is a single flake of snow and it gets flash frozen with super cooled water droplets. Interesting, yeah. I actually never heard that term before just now. Grapple. Yeah. Single flake of snow. Grapple. Super cooled water droplets. Hug it and it turns it into a spongy delight. All right. Yeah. Well, thank you for the question. <laughs> Ellen, of course, thank you for the answer. If you want to submit a question for the extended Ask Ellen segment, you can shoot a video and email it to the 7 on 8 at woodtv.com. Also, you can post it to social media and tag us on Facebook or Twitter.